Hey everybody, we are continuing our series of what do the golf greats do that you probably shouldn't do. Okay, so today we're gonna to talk Fred Couples, uh, Ricky Fowler, and then a concept called X Factor that Jim McClain came up with a number of years ago. Um, what both of those players do, but both of this, the X Factor is, it's keeping your hips still while turning against it, which is 100% true from an X Factor, it's always misunderstood. But Fred Couples and Ricky Fowler, they turn their hips like 15 or 20 degrees in the backswing. So their hips almost never move, but they really can turn against their hips. Well, most of the world, 99.9% .9 of the world, does not have that flexibility, mobility to be able to accomplish that. I spent half my life teaching people how to turn their hips because that's how we're gonna get a full swing, full backswing. So the whole concept of Fred Couples of staying super steady here and Ricky Fowler staying super steady and X Factor, which is the difference between your hip turn versus your shoulder turn, forget it. It's not for you, probably. You know, there's always an asterisk. So when you're swinging, I want you to try to feel some hip turn and that's gonna give us the ability to get fully turned. It's gonna give our arms some space to swing down. We aren't gifted like Freddie Couples. By the way, Freddie Couples has back problems. Hmm, I wonder if it has to do with his hips don't turn. So, if your hips don't turn and you try to turn your chest against it and you have back problems, you probably should turn your hips. So at the end of the day, turn your hips. Don't listen to X Factor, although it is a very good concept, just misunderstood. Don't do Ricky Valor, don't do Fred Couples. Let your hips go. Just let it go and have fun. See ya. Bye.